All right, guys, we're about to hit the road. I'm here getting some gas, and we are excited because I'm spending about five days up at the property. We're going to spend the weekend making some signs and stuff for my mom for the property, and then I'll be there till Wednesday, and I plan on getting some hog hunting in, looking for some sheds and just hanging out. Uh, I'll be working from the property. We did get some internet service out there, so I can hey, bud. So I can work out there now that I'm working from home and stuff. So we're excited to get out there and have a good time. And hopefully I can get a catch clean cook or just put a hog on the ground. And I've seen so many turkeys out there. I'll put up some pictures of some of the turkeys I've caught on my trail cameras. I mean, there's a lot of turkeys. So I'm excited for turkey season to open as well. So I'll turn you on when we get there. It's about 9 a.m. I've got a little bit of work to do around the property. I'm going to fill a couple feeders and I'm planning on getting some stuff ready for next season. Also going to do a little bit of scouting, see if I can find some good spots to hang a ladder stand or hunt out of with my saddle. And I also plan on bringing my 300 blackout with me because you never know when you're going to run into a hog out here. You can see all the rooting throughout here. The hogs have just destroyed this area. So I found a bed back there and then here we've got a old rub and then it looks like another rub up there so you can see this is where they may have been but it's nothing super fresh here so we'll just keep walking on and see if i can find some more sign it looks like it may be a little hog bedding area we've got scat all over this and it's all torn up I just walked up on a pretty heavy deer trail and it splits off and goes both ways here. I'm going to follow it one direction and see where it leads me. I can already see a scrape down there. So I'm going to start with that direction first. It's a small tree, but it's on this pretty heavy deer trail that goes off like that. So I'm at one of my feeders. I'm going to go ahead and fill it. This is the feeder we have the fence around and I'm going to turn it into a hog trap today and try and get that set up so that maybe we can trap some hogs this weekend. Since I'm here for four or five days, I figured might as well try and get that set up and we'll see how that goes. I got the feeder full. I just put four bags in it for now. I got one bag left here. I'm going to spread around the trap and then a little bit inside so that it leads them into the trap. All right, so here's how the trap is set up. You got a corral and then right here it can open. So I've put some corn along the edges. The hogs typically will come in here or here. Sometimes they'll come from behind me. So I've sprinkled some all the way around the edge to try and get them to come all the way around. Then I've got this piece here sticking out to kind of corner them right into here. And so when they come in here, this they'll push this open. And then it should close right behind them and they shouldn't be able to get out. One thing I thought about doing is setting this as a trap door and having a little trip line that comes across in here. But I'm going to see how this works for now. And hopefully uh, we get some hogs in here tonight and we can roast up a hog. So I was walking out to the stand and I'm about 75 yards away. And I noticed there's a ton of turkeys out there. They're literally right where my stand is. I'm just going to wait here and see if the, they take off before I walk out to the stand. Oh my god, I'm so mad. I didn't hit freaking record on my phone. 
I hope my GoPro's got that because that's my first possible kill with a bow. I'm pretty sure I got him. I saw the knot go through. It didn't look like he went all the way through, but he ran a little bit and I'm pretty sure I heard him fall. So I'm going to get down here and see if I can go find him real quick. So here is my arrow. The feeder's right there, so he came here and he turned and ran somewhere that way. Alright, so he went about, or she, went about 20 yards into the woods here. My broadhead had come off the arrow, so I don't know if it got stuck in it or what happened with that, but I'll just have to be careful when I'm gutting him. Alright guys, so we've had uh, a fun couple days, got the truck packed up, about to head back home. We got some concrete poured right here, and there's going to be a fire pit down there at the end. Pretty exciting weekend, killed my first animal with my bow, and that's all I was really looking to do. So I hope you all enjoyed this video, and if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Thanks guys.